to tell y'all. These past couple days been real good to me. God is good, ain't he? What is this video? Oh, I'm just gonna record these last couple of days of sophomore year. I'm gonna take y'all with me. I don't really have a I don't know what I'm doing. I'm just gonna record. I know this is my last day for my Spanish class and I got a presentation today. So I was like, might as well just be like, start today and like finish whenever. So that's the plan. It's gonna be a couple days in this vlog. Hope you enjoy because somebody was like, can you do longer video? And I'm like, I'm trying. Anyway, let me tell you the date for future Zoe so she can know what day it is. It is April 28th, 646, what? 648 in the morning. My class started at eight and it's about to be seven and I'm still sitting here. We don't even have time. We're rushing. Hello? Can you see me? Panic, panic. Okay, it's 7.43. Class starts at... Do I want my mascara on? I do, I do. Class starts at 8 o'clock and I'm not ready. We're gonna be a few minutes late. I need to put some lotion on. We're most definitely gonna be late. I've been late to this class a couple times. I can't even talk right now. I'm just, I feel too stressed. I hope it's hot outside because if I go outside and it's not, I'm gonna be so mad. I mean, at this point, it's like, you already late. Just take your time. Fuck it. How y'all doing? Y'all doing good? That's good, that's good. All right, I'm done. It's time to go to class. Okay, what time is it? It's 7.49. If I'm being honest, nobody goes to class early so me being late won't be a problem but yeah should i bring my computer sure fuck it why not right i might need it oh my blue, I need it. got my batteries got my camera i got my computer uh, sorry all right for real we're gonna go to class Last class, Spanish class. I just have three more classes in this seat. We got out early. We're supposed to get out at 9.20, but we got out at like 8.50 something. So I'm hella early. This class don't start till 9.30. So I got like 30 minutes. We don't ever do shit in this class. I like this teacher though. We're never on topic. We're always talking about life or something, which is what I like to talk about. Oh my God, y'all, I got a presentation. Pause. Okay, so you know how I was about to be late to class? She wasn't even there when I got there. So I wasn't even late, but I have a presentation for my next class. So I need to read it. Make sure I know how to read what I'm talking about. I gotta read this. The film titled The Hate You Give Miss because let me shut the fuck up. I should be good. It's not hard to read. It's 902. I got some time. I got a fart. This girl, she sit next to me. She be watching my videos. She probably gonna watch this one. Oh my god, I farted in a stink. Oh my no. We should be good now. I'm almost about to go home. I'm so excited. Y'all, guess what? I met the cheer team again. Bitch, I mean my sack before I I have to explain it later in detail what happened, but I made the team y'all. I was nervous. I was nervous. Every time I tell y'all what subscriber count I'm at, by the time I post this video, I be like far from where I be talking about. Y'all be doing the damn thing, don't y'all? We are. Light skin, and we can help you. I get it, I get it. If y'all need a podcast to watch as a black woman, but women anywhere, but specifically black women, you need to watch B. Simone's podcast. I think I already said this in my last video, but I'm going to say it again because it's such a good podcast. I'll put you on for real. I don't got to wake up no more at 6 o'clock for no damn class. I'm done with that class. <laughs> This lighting? Okay, I'm the only one. Imagine somebody's walking right now and I'm just sitting here recording myself. Now my camera about to die. That's real ghetto. If he cancels class early or something, could y'all sign me in? Hey, 
this class they always asking to be signed in but like it don't be enough people in the class to sign everybody in i'm just so ready to be done with these classes i'm so excited for next season y'all i love the team so far everybody seems so fun the dynamic of the team is so much different from last year's i can't wait for game day <laughs> I can't be like, no. what if it's blurry? What you want me to do? It's blurry. It is right now. Okay, it's cool now. Hey, hey, She goes first and I go after. I'm not really yeah, nervous, yeah. honestly. Sociology and minorities. Right. Next Tuesday is our last class. <laughs> Hey y'all. Hey. <laughs> we still not done with that clown. Tuesday or last day. We only got one more day. Ugh, the lighting's ugly. I wanna go to lunch. Cheese. I'm gonna go to the MSC right now because I'm hungry. I've been craving some nachos and that pizza, even though it's low-key nasty. And I haven't showed y'all the MSC yet. Well, she got the dogs out. Hey, Wait, how do we tag vlog? <laughs> this for your YouTube? Mm -hmm. That's my last class of the day. I never take notes in this class. Honestly, I don't take notes ever. It don't work for me. Recently, y'all, me and her, we always come in here hella early just to sit here. We just be talking. <laughs> Like for a whole hour. Oh, I didn't even show you how the classroom. And then sometimes it'd be like people in here. She was you should have everybody face. said, baby oh, said, oh. Did you see how she was laughing? Yeah. Like, but you're not funny. Said, All right. <laughs> Oh, okay. This is the infamous Andrew, aka Mr. Revis. Say hey to the vlog. Okay. And that's why we don't introduce him to the vlog, because he does the most. But anywho, what you gotta say to the vlog? Hold on, let me let me get it. Let me get it together. Let me get it together. I'm gonna be on here more. Who said that? Hey y'all. Where are you coming from? Let me guess some of you guys. The gym. Guys, remember when I have no friends? He's kind of my friend. <laughs> he the home girl. Pause. Before you even use that, he left a hate comment on one of my videos. Go attack him. Billy Eilish. Eilish? Get that right. Yeah, Are you she, playing music right now? Are you good? <laughs> What's up with you, man? What? The first one, everybody dies. <laughs> hey, this oh, picture is the dopest picture I've ever seen. Where do you take this in? Uh, Jamaica. You want to say hey to the vlog? She like, repping the hood. This is the only class I really okay, talked to everybody. That last episode. <laughs> hey, y'all. You know that. I well, know. That. Not <laughs> I'm doing my classes. Can this work? Like, what are you doing? I'm gonna nothing to do for the rest of the day, honestly. Okay, but I don't gotta. I gotta use the bathroom. I don't have no homework. It was like two bumps right here. And then they turned into these black marks. And now it's just like there and it's so ugly. What was I saying? Oh, I don't got no homework. I want Chipotle. I just, a big fat burrito I will love right now. I'm gonna start editing this video soon. But I just turned on this movie. You know how I get shit. When I turn on a movie, I feel like I ain't gotta do nothing. That's the plan for today. Nothing spectacular. Let me tell y'all about this cheer shit. Okay, so listen. So it was three days. Three days of trials. The first two days were clinic. That's when we like learned the dance, the cheer and the chant, all that stuff. And then the third day was the actual trial day. First day, it was great. I wasn't really too worried about the stunting because I feel like coach already knows how I am when it comes to stunting. It was more so like my personal stuff that I had to like focus on. Now, second day, I was happy with my performance. He had a conversation with me and the other girl that was a returner and he was like talking to us. Before even trials, we had knew that there was gonna be two teams. There was gonna be the co-ed team and there was gonna be the all girls team. Co-ed is with the boys and then the all girls is like girls at base, back spot, all that stuff. So I wanted to be on co-ed because the co-ed team is a team that travels and that's the best part about being on the team. Well, that's one of the best parts about being on the team is that we get to travel. So I for sure wanted to be on co-ed. Second day comes, he has a conversation with me and this other girl. He was low-key asking us how would we fit what so i felt like he was low-key trying to ask us how would we feel about being on all girls and i told him i'm like coach i don't want to like i don't want to be on all girls like i want to be on co-ed and the first day when we did stunting i didn't do co-ed i went to the all girls section i went up to talk to him i said coach do you think i should try out with the co-ed team he was like i was gonna cut you because you didn't go try out with the co-ed team i was like but he was just playing though i knew he was playing honestly i just needed that like confirmation that he wanted me to go try out on the co-ed team so the second day i went to go try out with the co-ed team but there's not enough boys they just sent the extra 
girls to all girls. I was confused because I'm like, okay, if I can't try with co-ed, then how am I gonna make the co-ed team? I knew he had a plan because me and Big Sid, we had went and asked him, we were like, do you want us to try with the co-ed team? He was like thinking about it. So clearly he had a plan. I was like, I need to know what he's thinking because I don't like not knowing, especially when it comes to like something about me. Like I wanna know what you thinking. Am I on the freaking, what? Third day, I just prayed about it. I was like, you know what? All I can do is pray. It's out of my hands. If it's in God's will, then he'll deliver it for me. He'll do it for me. If you want me on a team, you put me on a team. If you don't, he don't. I got this, it is what it is mindset about it. And I was like, fuck it, whatever. Me and my group, we the last group. And I tried out with my stunt group. The first day we learned, we learned chant one and we learned the cheer. Second day we learned the dance and chant two. What, boy? Oh, this is my mom. Uh -huh. We had to do everything that we learned, plus jumps and tumbling. When I tell y'all, I was drained. I was like, my body was dear. Can I speak? My body was deteriorating each day. It was just getting lower and lower. And then I was also stressing because I had a project due that Saturday. Trial started at 7 a.m., meaning I had to get up at 6 o'clock. Damn near 5 o'clock. We want to... Oh my God, can we stop texting me right now? Woke up at like five something. Jamerica did my makeup. We went to trials. We had like an hour to practice and go over everything. At this point, I knew everything. The whole time, me and my group was back there waiting. We was practicing every time the music would go for the other groups that were performing. We would do the dance. Me and my stunt group, we were not hitting the stunt. When we were practicing it, it was not hitting. But y'all, by the grace of God, our stunt hit surprisingly. Let me tell you how it went. It's four of us, right? Because that's the stunt group. I go do a little tumble pass then everybody do their tumble pass their best tumble pass and then we stand in the line then they start carrying toe touch do it okay pipe okay toe touch tuck okay back handspring tuck back to back to back okay stand and tuck like we had no time to breathe right after that we had to do the freaking fight song and then after the fight song we had to do the cheer and then after the cheer we had to do the dance and i didn't even care about the stunt i was like if the stunt don't hit i don't even care we prayed before we went out there i prayed all damn day i said lord i need you in that stunt with me like lord i need you right there on the mat with me he was there because that was a miracle that's god's work and that's nothing but god i only messed up once and i was on the dance i missed like emotion or whatever but then i caught back on after we did tryouts we had a whole football game four hours after tryouts so the new people that made the team that don't know nothing that don't know the cheers no stands no nothing we played ourselves like it was pv versus pv half of the football team was on one side and the other half was on the other and they played against each other it was a scrimmage oh i didn't tell y'all i made co-ed but listen this is how it went so we all sat down we had numbers by the way they was like okay if we call your number go to the room to bat i'm sitting down I'm like lord please 38 38 38 38 38 me and Jalen, we were sitting next to each other she's 39 i'm 38 so they was like 38 and i got up and i walked to the back and everybody that was in the back that was the people that made co-ed Jalen, she walked in me and Sydney Jay was like ah! the all girls team they didn't find out who made the team till that Monday which is kind of messed up and speaking of cheer we had went to tumbling open gym I did a full for the first time if you don't know what a full is look it up it's been a couple hours it's 7 36 my wallet is right here my wallet is right here okay shut up it feels really good outside that's a fine young man can't really see his face but his body cute i lied he ugly oh look at all the look at all the boys playing basketball that's so cute i love like how everybody has friends imagine really like coming to college and then finding your best friends and getting to live with them how fun is that y'all damn caesar just came out with a new song it was the first three seconds of that song i said oh if I was a music, I would be Dan Caesar. Every song in his album just hits every single time. There's not a lot of artists that I like that hit every single time. And then he came out with um, some merch for his songs. I for sure bought it. It should be at my house in approximately five weeks. The lighting is super cute right now. It's golden hour. Best time to take pictures. I haven't took pictures in a long time. Y'all used to take pictures like a lot. It's because I don't have nobody to take my pictures. I hate bothering people when it comes to taking my pictures. And I like my pictures taken in a specific way. So if I ask you to take my pictures and you act like you have attitude i'm never gonna ask you again so therefore i don't ask people to take my pictures my mom normally takes my pictures but you know since she's in california and i'm in texas she can't take my pictures that's a beautiful song can we just talk about how great that song is that song will forever be a banger my kids will know that song they will know it by heart anyways we're at target I'm, we're at chick-fil-a can i have a medium um, ice cream cone and a large cup of ice. That's all. I didn't say thank you. It's kind of fucked up. What's your favorite Tic Tac sound at the moment? Mine is... Oh my god! Golly! No, it's one funnier than that. I don't know. I gotta go on TikTok to see. My love is short love. That song just came into my head and I was like, we should listen to it. We meaning me and my personalities. I think I really only have two personalities. So depending on what I read from you, that's who you get. You can either get the quiet reserve Zoe or the talkative, goofy, 
Don't shut up, Zoe. Thank you. My pleasure. My pleasure. My pleasure. I used to say that at Canes. I don't work at Canes no more. I just hate working. That's my problem. Canes was cool. Canes was honestly actually the best job I've had thus far. And I've had quite a few. I think I've had like seven or eight or nine jobs. I don't know. Canes was up there for sure. It was simple, easy. The people was annoying, but it was bearable. Ooh, it's getting dark outside. Oh, speaking of Canes, y'all, they gave me a little uh, going away goodie bag. I got, um, they gave me a water bottle. They gave me a chain, I mean, a little, what's it call it? What is this called? Bro, hold on. I'm at the Chick-fil-A thing. Thank you. you one or two straws. Well, I don't need to try it all. Oh, anyways, back to what I was saying. Now we're on our way to Chipotle, which is literally right there. Not even like a minute away. It's in the next, it's over in the next, like, Bro, y'all don't care. Just know it's close. How about that? But anyways, Canes gave me a little going away bag, as y'all just seen. And I was surprised. I'm like, I don't know y'all fucked with me like that. When I go in there, don't nobody be talking to me. I mean, they talk to me, but like, I really be just to myself. Hello, can you focus? They was like, guys, come to the back. We're going to have a little meeting. And then I was like, hmm, what's this about? They was like, so Zoe's going away. She's going back home to California. We just wanted to give her a little going away thing or whatever. I was like, oh, for me? can't be i was surprised that they even cared about me oh i told them i gotta quit i'm going back home and i gotta know where to live so they put me on leave that just means that i can go back when i get back out here in texas i can go back there but i just really don't want to work i just made sure that i gave myself the opportunity to choose if i wanted to go back to Kane or not i feel like i was smart do y'all listen to destin conrad if you don't i put you on what's so funny is i used to watch his vines and he used to like do little singing vines sometimes and i'd be like oh my god i wish he came out with music because i would really fuck with his music fast forward years later he's came out with music and I love his freaking music. I got an ice cream cone from Chick-fil-A. Can y'all guess what this is? Hi, Silly Lemonade Mix. Hello. I got a cup of ice. I eat the ice and then once the ice is gone, I pour more ice into it. I don't like to eat ice by itself. I don't like water and it just tastes like water. I need it to have some flavor. The high Silly Lemonade Mix give it flavor and it make the ice just like 10,000 bazillion, gazillion, bazillion times better. Just if y'all wanted to know, you know, maybe somebody out there gonna care, you know? Somebody out there gonna resonate with what I just said. Wow, like, I'm really finna be a junior. Well, technically, I am a junior right now because my credits. But if we're going by years, I'm a sophomore. But my sophomore year is really about to be over. And I really don't give a fuck. I mean, I like college. I fuck with the, like, you know, I fuck with the vibe of college. But, like, the schoolwork, cut it out. I'm just tired of school, period. Like, when I'm gonna stop learning? I feel like I've been learning my whole life. What else can y'all teach me? Like, come on. Damn, I should have brought my glasses. I can't see at night. I mean, I can see, but it should be real blurry. And I can only see, like, what's right in front of me. Back to what I was showing y'all my little canes giveaway not giveaway going away bag giddy bag goody bag whatever got this water bottle never gonna use probably not this lanyard that's what it's called a lanyard these ugly ass glasses i will never wear in my life the the water bottle holder thingy my barber a pen okay can you give me something i'm actually gonna like like Silicone smart wallet. Oh, this going on back of your phone. That's cute, but I wouldn't wear no cane shit like that. They gave me a scrunchie. Okay, this is cute. A cane scrunchie. Hello? Some freaking canes chapstick. You don't got no canes chapstick. I do though. You wish you me. None of this I fell in love with. So it's a thought that counts though. You know, they thought about me. I knew she was just in that office just throwing shit in the bag. But you know, it's okay. Cause at least she thought about me. And then they all clapped for me. Whole time they don't know I'm never coming back. I might probably not though, but there's a one percent chance I'm that I might go back. Best part ice cream cone is the cone. I remember when they didn't give out ice cream cones because of COVID. What does ice cream cone got to do with COVID? Just put a glove on. I never understood that. That pissed me off. Y'all didn't have an ice cream cone for like months. <gasps> a year. I just got the summer information for cheer. Okay, it say May 7th, and then it say May 21st. My trip is May 25th. Meet and greet. Who we meeting? <laughs> what? June 2nd. June 18th! That's my birthday! <laughs> There's no fucking way. July 16th, 17th, 18th, 19th, 20th, 21. He's crazy. I have to call my mom immediately. Honestly, I don't really care. No, I do care. No. Do I? <laughs> Hold on, Sydney's calling me. May 21st though? Like, what's the point of going home? What are we gonna do before that? Right, I didn't even read that part. I didn't really have plans for my birthday, but like, I didn't want to do this shit on my birthday. The bag is secured, we have got the food. This cheer shit just really fucked up my whole summer schedule. This ice going crazy though. It's these 8 a.m.s for me. What do you mean 8 a.m.? This is really making me feel like an athlete or something. I'm really like, I'm busy, like, I got shit to do. This is funny, fuck, like, damn. I'm complaining, but I like having shit to do. Like, it just made me feel like, like I'm doing something with my life. You know what I'm saying? 
we back in my room from chipotle i get a burrito i really want to try a bowl i'm gonna try it one day i used to get the shredded shredded whatever that shit used to make me throw up i think i might have like something wrong with my stomach because y'all don't care i'm finna watch i don't know i just like hello i'm finna watch the kardashians on hulu their new tv show and i'm gonna eat this food that's probably gonna be it for today i'm gonna see y'all on whatever day i pick up this camera Every time I find like a new like location for my camera in my room, I get so excited. But anyways, it's tomorrow. It is Friday, April 29th, 10.55 in the morning. Today is freshman orientation. Me and some of the other cheerleaders are gonna go help teach some chants. That's what they told us. That's all I really know. That's what we're gonna do right now. It started at 10.30, it's 10.55. I was indecisive. I was laying in the bed. I'm like, do I really feel like doing this right now? And I was like, it'll be good for the vlog. That's what got me up, honestly. I was like, the vlog needs to see this. Maybe you don't. Oh, Jamaica, these bumps are crazy on my face. Why is it not working? Walk out. Oh wait, no, I'm nervous now. I can't. I can't. I'm nervous. Okay, I'm coming. If you couldn't hear, she said that the kids are not interested in that. It's boring. I'm not a hype man. I can't entertain children. So I don't know how this is gonna go. We're just gonna go home for the bed. What the fuck? And then also today's Catfish Friday. If you don't know what Catfish Friday is, every Friday the cafeteria does catfish, macaroni, and I think that's it. It'd be so good to be having like the little hot sauce. We gotta go to Catfish Friday. And I haven't been in a while, so I was like, might as well take the vlog. They told us to wear a PV cheer shirt. Pretty basic, ugly outfit, but it is what it is. Honestly, I'm only taking this backpack so I can put my batteries in it. I'm lost. I don't know if I'm in the right building or not. This is the Agricorp, the Agricorp. Fuck it, I don't even know how to say it. Y'all hear you watching my YouTube? I feel like I'm that shit. It's been a long time since I was recording y'all. Y'all don't mind my scarf. I look like I'm bald headed. I look like a young man. Anyways, last thing I recorded, I was at freshman orientation. Being honest, that was like low-key lame. I don't know. It just wasn't giving what it was supposed to give. It was just not doing what it was supposed to do. After that, I went to the cafeteria because I wanted to go get cafe try, like I said. Walked in there and I got irritated for some reason. I was like, I don't even want it no more. Because it was just too much people in there and I was by myself. I don't want to sit in there by myself. Like, and they didn't have to go. And I was just irritated. I was like, I don't even want to be here anymore. So I came back to my room. I started watching YouTube and I got sleepy. And I was like, well, might as well just go ahead and take this nap. I went to sleep at like one. I woke up at like five. And then I tried to edit this video. I don't got no food here, so I got hungry. I went to Domino's. I didn't record it because it just wasn't feeling like it. And then I was on the phone with Sydney. Look at my pizza sitting on my thing. I was going to eat it, but I just got tired of it and it got cold. When I called Domino's and I was talking, he going to say, yes, sir. Excuse me? I'm a ma'am. Is my voice that deep or something? Like, is my voice even deep? I'm about to journal. I started December 27th, 2020. That was the time. It was. I only wrote this much. That's not a lot compared to what I have left. I got some ways to go. But when it's completely it's gonna be so satisfying to me. I don't really have prompts. No, I did see this prompt thing on, on Pinterest. Let me show you. I was just scrolling on Pinterest as I do. And then I seen this journal prompt thing. And I was like, whoa, that's kind of cute. Letter to future self. I like that. Current obsessions. I should do that like monthly. I should make that a thing. Write a poem. I'm not that like creative. Recall embarrassing moments. I cannot. Oh, I forgot I wrote that whole. Wow, I have a lot to say. I'm about to keep replaying this freaking Daniel Caesar song that I just am obsessed with so far. Did I tell you already? I think I did. Please don't lean. That song is like a gift from the Lord. The Lord himself wrote that song. And you cannot tell me otherwise. Sweet Emily, stand next to me. You're all you need. I need to give it all. I got to live what I got. I don't know why you're the one. Join me out of well now that's over i finished my one why am i singing i finished my one page it's like homework i finished my one page i didn't even know this thing had this i just discovered it it's 11 52 i'm not really tired because i told you i took a nap but i do need to take a shower though Y'all, I just woke up. It is Tuesday, May 3rd, and I only got two classes today. But I have to take this um final for my child psychology class. But I gotta be at class by 11. So I gotta hurry up and do this exam, get ready for class, and then go to class. I'm about to finish watching um Messy Monday. Y'all watch Messy Monday? You know, Lil James. Okay, so I'm done now. I haven't turned in my quiz yet. I have one more to answer. I'm trying to run the clock out. I finished my exam, it was 50 questions. And then I was also watching The Hobbit while I was taking my exam. <laughs> Hands up high, hands up high. Hands up high. 
Lisa hates the ball. Yeah, my Levi's fucked up. Man. They don't judge. They don't judge. They don't judge. I was really doing it. No, you were smart though. Wait, what's your grade? And it's class. I don't even know. I ain't gonna lie. I got an 80 on my. How you be passing? Hey, Miss Girl. A 64. We still got a 66. I'm not even finna complain. Shit. But they great. They definitely great. Everybody else basic, you live life on an everyday basis with poetic justice, poetic justice. If I told you that a flower bloom in the dark. I got this shirt from like Paxson or some shit a long time ago. These shorts, you ever wear any CNEs? And then I got these Converse. Converse are probably my favorite shoes right now. I didn't really record that much today. I don't really have that much to record. Tuesday's favorite day. Why? Both my favorite podcasts come out. And on top of that, I don't got shit to do today. And I got Chick-fil-A. I was trying to go a video without eating Chick-fil-A, but like, I didn't feel like going off campus today. And Chick-fil-A was right there. Plus, I was also in the student store. Because I got some more PV merch. And I went to the little um snack station. What is it called? Like, it's not a grocery store. It's like, it gives gas station. Like, the little, bro, I don't know. Let's got me a water and a Gatorade because I don't got nothing here to drink. Today was an easy day. I didn't do nothing. My first class, we literally just sat there and people presented. And in my second class, we literally did nothing. We sat there and she talked about, I don't even remember what she was talking about. I wasn't listening. I was just zoning out in my own world. On Thursday, I only got one class to go to. I'm going to talk to y'all later. I was about to say, I'm going to talk to y'all tomorrow, but no, I got, I got something else to say. I'm going to watch my podcast. I'm eating my food. And I'm going to talk to y'all when I got something else to say. Okay, hey. So listen, here's my dilemma. My trick coach, he told me I need to have my splits by Saturday. So my plan is to sit in the splits while I try to like get my videos uploaded for this next video, right? But the thing is like, I don't want to do that. I feel like we all have choices in life and I choose not to know how to do the splits. I mean, I did one two at a time, but it was like at a point it was like, so it's not in you, let it go. And I let it go. I'm not even close. Sometimes life throws you things and you gotta just roll with it. I don't know where I got that from, but it's something. I want to show you how far I am my place because this is embarrassing like as a cheerleader i need y'all to scoop back though like y'all two in my face like, give me some personal space i get we're like this but like give me some space oh <laughs> Hold on, let me change my shirt. I need y'all to, my, yeah. All right, so I didn't went ahead and change my whole little fit. It was given like, you trying to be cute with Miss Ma'am. You're trying to do the splits. Like, let's get it together. Okay, I lied. I changed my pants again, cause you know, I'm gonna be doing the splits. I don't want y'all, you know, all up in my stuff. Ooh, not me having a hole in my side. We ain't gonna worry about it. I ain't even gonna stretch. Should I? I should, but like, I don't feel like, this is not fun. Like, who enjoys this? I can't do it. I can't, like seriously. My body telling me like, girl, get up off this floor and I'ma listen. What is my problem right now? I don't even know, like. Hey y'all, it's a new day. We in the car with it. It is Thursday, May 5th, my last days of class. Anyways, ooh, I forgot I got gas. I'm proud of me. Off topic, babe. Like, come on. I feel like these past couple days have been so chaotic. It's because I don't do shit, like, ever. So when anything slightly happens, I'd be like, oh my god, life is fucking crazy. This shit's wild. But, like, all I did was go to dinner. Like, that shit's so spontaneous to me. That shit is not nothing. But to me, it be ooh, that dog is so cute. I didn't even tell y'all where I was going. I'm at Waffle House. My class don't start till 2 o'clock. It's 11. I got some time. Y'all, look at my case. I'll be on Instagram like this, just scrolling and shit. It's not supposed to do that. me a waffle and i got large bacon and hash browns and i got orange juice y'all my hands is clean so don't try to do me y'all this final today i don't think i'm prepared but like i told you i don't study so i'm really just winging it at this point i'm always asking y'all have y'all watched something the circle just came out with a new season yesterday and i already watched the first four episodes I'm about to show y'all all my PV stuff and I just bought some on Tuesday. I got another PV crew neck. I got this like crop top-ish PV shirt. I just got like this lounge shirt. It's a HBCU brand new. This is all of my PV stuff that I have so far. Shirts and stuff under my bed, but I'm too lazy to get that. Why somebody in the group chat, the chill group chat was like, we have an open gym from five to seven. I don't know to see. I feel like I'm always doing something. Golly. In this last minute, like, you couldn't tell me yesterday so I could mentally prepare myself. Y'all, the reason why I'm really tired is because I was up till, like, 5 o'clock in the morning. And then I went to sleep from 5 to 8. Three hours of sleep. So I'm running out for three hours of sleep right now. I'm tired. I just want to go to sleep. I don't even want to talk. I don't want to see nobody. I don't want to do anything. I just want to lay down. I just feel like this video, I'm just going like this. Like, I'm just decreasing as the video goes along. Because at the beginning of this video, I was... And now I'm just like... I'm making weak today run insane. 
So I'm done with practice, y'all. Well, it was open gym. All I did was tumble the whole time. Some of the girls on the cheer team were having like a get together, like a team bonding. I don't know. We're gonna go to Treasure's room, her little apartment in the view. She's on the team. I need to figure out an outfit. I don't know what I'm wearing. Oh, I took a mean nap, y'all. I showed her my stuff. I went to sleep for two hours and then I went to class. I didn't even film that. I went to my last class and took my final. It was 100 questions. I guessed the entire time. I don't know if I answered at least one question for sure. No, I answered like three. I know for sure it's right. Out of 100, I was just guessing. Cause there's no, there's no way, no. Mm -mm. Today felt like such a like a like a go with the flow day, which is so not me. But I kind of like her. I got this flannel on. I don't really wear this shirt. I think I don't know where I got it from. These pants I got from Fashion Trend, but also these pants these pants don't fit me. Struggle of being like skinny with long legs. This took me a good 20 minutes to pick out. Yeah. I don't wanna know if you give me in the in the hey. She said to come at uh, 10 45. It's 10 20 something. I'm just so happy I don't have nothing to do tomorrow. Can we acknowledge that I'm done with class? I want to get some more tattoos, but I don't know what I want to get. <laughs> yes, ma'am. I like it. Do you have another option, or was that just your first choice? I literally forgot I had Waffle House this morning because when I took that nap, it just felt like it was a new day. Some people in the comments be asking me, could you recommend any other, like, Hold on. Okay, so definitely the rap. A few people in the comments asked me like, could you recommend any college vloggers? And y'all, you know, I don't watch college vloggers. The only time I watched college content was when I was in high school. And now that I'm in college, it's like, I don't really care to see other college stuff because I'm already doing my own college stuff. But these are the people that I'm subscribed to. Zane and Heath, Corey Kenshin, Keenan JC, The 85 South Show, B. Simone, Zoe, I Am Zoe, Bailey Sarian, Life with Lena, Leah Lee, I'll forever subscribe to her, Sarah Baska, she's hilarious, Haley Elizabeth, Marla Catherine, Kiana Naomi, if you don't know who that is go subscribe to her Hines love him Janelle don't know how to say her last name Yellow and Death Mia Joshua something he makes like food shit where's 22 which is Michael Rainey Jr. so those are the people I'm subscribed to y'all it is 10 54 and it's time to go Listen, I can explain. It was fun. Most definitely 10 out of 10. That was also a problem as to why I didn't record. But it wasn't bad or nothing, y'all. It was fun. There was also other cheer people there too. So it was like, I can't, we can't put that out there. You know what I'm saying? I literally took my camera though. But once I got there, I said, oh no, this this is not a vlogging party, babe. This is not a vlog party. Just use your imagination. One of the girls that was there, she had texted in the group chat. She was like, I'm gonna put it right here. And then somebody else had swiped up on my story that I posted and said this. Like people really think I'm really anti-social. Like, do I give off the I mean, of course I posted two videos about being a loner, but like that don't mean I'm not fun. But people really think like I'm really anti-social. It's not that I'm anti-social, it's that I just feel like I can't vibe with everybody and I look for like actual friendships. You know, I've had the friends where I just went out all the time and we just did fun shit. I had those type of friendships before. I'm looking for like some deeper shit. So I guess like because I look for deeper shit and I feel like a lot of people don't offer that, I just be like, oh, I'm good. But I'd rather be by myself than to be with some surface level people. I don't know, but like niggas really think I'm some like in a bubble like anti-social bitch. That's not me really. To my core, that's not me. I don't fucking know, but I just thought that was weird. Not weird, but I thought it was just like strange. Not even strange. I thought it was interesting. I don't fucking know. I thought it was something to share. How do I feel? Sophomore year's done with y'all. I really don't be feeling, I, I have feelings. I should be feeling some type of way, but I really do not care. I mean, it's just another day for me, shit. I'm just talking at this point. Like, I ain't got nothing to say. It's me trying to have a reflection point in this video. Reflection of my sophomore year. How do I feel? Girl, stop trying to be like so damn sentimental and you know, that. Don't nobody care about your reflection of sophomore year? No, but for real, let me tell y'all. How was my sophomore year? Um, it was cool. I'm slowly meeting people, y'all. I'm slowly having friends. Y'all probably like, girl, do you have friends or not? Like, you stay talking about that shit. But it's like, I'm weird. Just let me be. Let me be. But I guess I'm done. I have nothing else to say. I'm talking like I'm not gonna see y'all in the next video. What I'm not saying now, most definitely gonna be said in the next video but anyways that's it for today's video i hope you enjoyed come along with my couple of days very random vlogging not really organized not very much zoe zoe's organized but this one i was just like winging it can we bring this back i do that shit all the time and i'm great i hope you guys enjoyed it and i will see you guys in my next vlog <laughs>